find a limit as x approaches 2 from the right of this expression. So if you just plug in 2, it won't work because you'll get 0 on the bottom. So the idea is to eliminate the absolute value. So recall that the absolute value of x is a piecewise function. This is super useful. It's x if x is greater than or equal to 0, and it's minus x if x is less than 0. So in this problem, we have the absolute value of x minus 2. So we need to figure out if x minus 2 is bigger than 0 or smaller than 0. So to do that, we can use this condition here. So x is approaching 2 from the right. That means that x is bigger than 2, right? Because here's 2. If it's approaching from the right, that means it's on the right. And it's going towards 2. That means it's a bigger number. So x is bigger than 2. That means x minus 2 is bigger than 0. And that means, here's the beautiful part, that the absolute value of x minus 2, because it's positive, is just x minus 2. If instead, like, let's just pretend for a moment that x was approaching 2 from the left. In that case, in that case, it'd be over here, right, approaching from the left. That would mean that x is smaller than 2. That would mean that x minus 2 is less than 0. And that would mean that the absolute value of x minus 2 would be minus x minus 2, right? Just the formula. The formula tells you that it's just x if x is positive or 0, and it's minus x if x is negative. So if this is positive, you just write it. If this is negative, you put a negative sign in front of it. This problem is easier in the sense that it's just positive. So this is this, and then you just replace the top piece with x minus 2 because we're using this condition because we're approaching from the right. It's a beautiful problem. Really, really nice. Really important technique. This is a reoccurring thing. It's a harder problem, but it's an important one. This cancels. So this is the limit as x approaches 2 from the right of 1. And that's just going to be 1. And that would be the final answer. Just for fun, I know the question didn't ask it, but let's say it was the limit as x approaches 2 from the left. Say it was this. So in this case, x approaches 2 from the left. So it's over here. It's approaching from the left. So it's less than 2. So x minus 2 is less than 0. So you put a negative, right, because it's approaching from the left. So this is equal to the limit as x approaches 2 from the left. And this is minus x minus 2 over x minus 2. These cancel, so this is the limit as x approaches 2 from the left of negative 1, which would just be negative 1. So that would be the answer if it was a minus. And why not? We have time. There's no rush, right? So if it was just this, say it was just x approaching 2, just for fun, just for learning purposes, because math is beautiful. From the right, we got 1. From the left, we got negative 1. Therefore, the limit from both sides does not exist. Right? This, this function has a discontinuity at 2, and it's non-removable extra knowledge because uh, this limit is DNA, just extra life knowledge there. Anyways, uh, <laughs> carried away. This is the problem, and the answer is, is 1. I hope this video has been helpful in some way. Good luck.